Hi, thanks for joining us today. This is Peter Stormer, Thermal Camera Sales Manager for T-Equipment.net and ThermalCameraExperts.com. Today we're going to talk quickly about the uh, new Seek uh, for both the iOS and for the Android. We have two different versions of the Seek now. These thermal cameras are both available in the standard, what they call um, the standard range view and also the extra range view. Now we're going to show the differences between them on an Android and on an iPhone, actually an iPad. Um, showing you quite how different the um, ranges are. So we're going to show you real quickly. So here this is on an uh, Android device, looking at an electrical panel. You can actually see the, oh, there we go, go this way, go in the wrong direction. Oh. Let's do it like this, okay. So we're going to show, so that's the electrical panel here on our office. So we're just taking a look at it to see how it looks thermally. Comparing that, to the extra range version. And you can see how much closer you're getting with this. Oh, come on, we don't need to see this. Okay, let's get rid of that. And you can actually see, again, the visual. Look at how close up that is, that panel. You can see how much extra zoom you're getting with this compared to the thermal camera. And let's hold them up side by side, and you can see how much more close up you're getting, you still get the center spot capability and all the other capabilities that the standard uh, Seek unit has as far as the thermal camera goes for either an iOS or an Android device. But look at how much closer you're getting with the extra range. So that's just a quick overview showing you how the two of them differ. If you have any questions, please feel, please feel free to uh, comment below or give us a call. Thanks very much and have a great day.